Hi, I am Yusi from Oscar Tech. I am an online instructor. On this channel, I make videos on data analysis, tech productivity, and many more. So if any of such content interests you, please consider hitting the like, share, and subscribe button. And also don't forget to click on the notification bell so that YouTube can notify you when I upload any such content. In today's video, I will show you how you can download and install Microsoft 365 on your PC for free. If you don't know what Microsoft 365 is, well, it is actually the latest version of Microsoft Suite. It comes with apps short as Microsoft Word, Publisher, Excel, OneNote, and many more. So it's basically a collection of different productivity apps. This version of Microsoft Office comes with a lot more functionalities than the others. It actually saves backup all your documents online as you work on them. So you don't run the risk of losing whatever file you are working on. You can use it for free online, but you will not be able to download and install it on your PC unless you pay for it monthly or yearly subscription. But in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can download and install it on your laptop for free without having to pay for the monthly or yearly subscription. First of all, you need to have a Microsoft account. If you don't know how to create a Microsoft account or Gmail account, please let me know in the comment section so that I can make a video for you. Now, if you already have a Microsoft account, go to your Google Chrome and type in office.com. and click enter. Now, once you are there, make sure you sign in with your Microsoft account. When you click sign in, enter your password, you will see a dashboard like this. Once you have seen this dashboard, if you, you will see install app. Now, if you click install app, you will see that they will tell you go premium. This means that you need to buy it from them. But in today's video, I will show you how to get it for free. So stick with me. Now, let's open another tab and type Microsoft Developer. And click enter. Now, once you are there, Click the first link. Now, look for Microsoft 365. This is it here. Click it. Now, once you're there, go down and look for Go down and look for Join Microsoft 365 Developer Program and click Join Today. As you can see, this is it here. Click it. Now, click Join Now. Now, this dashboard here shows you that you should put the relevant information like your country. Now, you should just go to this drop down and select the country. As you can see, there are so many counties here. I select my country. Now that I've selected my country, you don't necessarily need a company or create a company. As for me, I'll just put in my YouTube channel. I just put in the name of my YouTube channel and if your language is not English, just click the drop down button and you will see different languages here. So as for me, I just leave it like that. Click the first box, then leave this one on ticked, then click next. Now once you are here, they are asking you that what is your primary focus as a developer? Now, as for me, I'll just choose personal project and click next. Now, once you're here, 
The question is, what area of Microsoft 365 developer are you interested in development? Are you interested in? So now you can choose multiple here. You can choose anyone here. As for me, I'll just choose Microsoft team and click save. Now, once you're here, just click next. Then fill in the necessary information here. You are required to put your name. For me, I'll just put, or let me see. So once you are here, just make sure you put in the password. and then leave this box on ticked, then click continue. After putting your password, just click continue. Then here, this is the position where you are asked to put a phone number, where they will send you a code. It's a verification code. So once you enter the phone number, you will receive a verification code. Now I'm going to put the phone number that they are going to send the code. Click send code. Now go to your mobile phone and look look on your text message. Now they have just sent me the code. Just enter the code here. Then click Setup. Now this is what we want. This is what we want. So what you are going to do now is we will just open a new tab. Please don't close this tab. This is exactly what we want. Now we are just going to open a new tab and type in Microsoft Store. and click enter. Now, if you click Microsoft Store, just go to Microsoft Store-Apps. Now, once you are here, just go to your top right and click search. T type in Office. Just close this. Once you are here, just look for shop. When you click shop, close this. Then look for office free. As you can see, this is it here. Just click on it. Now, once you are here, just go to get, get install, then click this open Microsoft store. Now, this is it. Sometimes you will see install or get when you click that button here, you will just wait for it to download. After it's finished downloading, just click open. Now, when you click open, try to sign in with the account you just created. Just click sign in. 
Now, we look for the account we just created. You click um, workplace or school account, then click continue. Now, go back to the dashboard and copy this link. Just copy this email, sorry. Then go to your office, then paste it here. Click next. Now, make sure you enter the password you just created. Then click sign in. Now, click next. Now, once you are here, you need to download an app called Microsoft Authenticator or you just have to choose a, another method in which they will send you the code. Now, just click like this. Then, choose the method through your phone. Then, click confirm. Now, what you have to do here is you choose your country. You choose your country, then enter a phone number. Then you click next. They will send you a text message. Now, go to your message box and enter the number you see there. Then, click Next. Click Next again. Now, as you can see, success. Now, just make sure you click done. You wait for it. Now, as you can see, you have already entered your, 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 your Microsoft account. You are ready to go. Now, click the Install app, then click the Microsoft 365 app at the top. Then now you wait until it's finished downloading. Now once it is done, just click a folder and double click on it to install. Now run this. Click yes. Just wait for it. Well, let me remind you, it's always installed online. Don't turn off your Wi-Fi. Just wait for it to install. Now, as you can see, it is downloading all the packages. So now once you are done, go to sign in. Once you go to sign in, Go to the dashboard, copy the email address you just created, and then paste it here and click Next. Now, once you are here, just type in your password.
then click sign in now once you are here they are going to send you a verification code just click it now go to your mobile phone and type in the verification code <coughs> and click verify so now just close this once you are done all the apps will be activated then open a blank document Once you are here, you will see that it is activated. You will see it is activated, all of this. So now, if you want to know if it is activated, this is your account. Just go to File, go to Account. Then you will see your subscription here. This is it. You are OK now. You can use any app as you want. Or just make sure you connect your computer every 30 days on a network so that you will not be deactivated just once okay all right thank you very much in the next videos we will be talking about microsoft word from beginner stage to the advanced stage